Founded 20 years ago, the Philadelphia Sports Hall of Fame already has more than 300 inductees, 17 of them honored during the ceremony last week at Live Casino. Among this year's inductees were late Villanova head basketball coach Roly Massimino, longtime St. Joe's coach Phil Martelli, and Flyers original head coach and longtime general manager Keith Allen. A handful of Broad Street bully era Flyers were on hand at the event in support of Keith the Thief. Another inductee. That would be Philly's all-time hits leader and 2007 NL MVP. And, of course, the shortstop on those 2008 World Championship fills, Jimmy Rollins. And I talked briefly with J. Roll about his latest honor and about being there to watch the 2022 fills in the series. And, yes, it was a bit noisy there at the casino. How do you feel to be back in Citizens Bank Park with so many of your old teammates this past week? Uh, you know what? That was absolutely fantastic. Uh, we obviously come back together in 2018 for the senior reunion of the World Series. But we were the ones that celebrated, so you know, all the attention is on you, not on the guys on the field. Uh, in this situation, it's like a reminder of how great these fans are. And we're not the ones that are celebrating. We're there, and they give us loud cheers, but it's the team on the field that they're there. And a lot of people say that you know they remind uh, them of us. No, I told them go make their own legs. You know, make them talk about the 2022 things. And oh wait, Philly, we'll be okay. Our legacies are already cemented. We make them remember you. And so to see it happening, to see the fans show up, uh, to see the players deliver. It's been just amazing. And how about you, Willie, the Philadelphia Sports Hall of Fame? What's that mean to you? Uh, it's, it's crazy. Uh, it's something I never really you know, thought about for me. Uh, you know, the hardest thing was to win over the fans and, and become a part of the, a part of the city, being the other city. Um, so to be honored, you know, to be black, and I'm going to be forever in this Sports Hall of Fame when my kids grow up or want to take a trip back home. So I have two daughters that were born here. The youngest uh, was born in Chicago. They can know that their dad had a place that loved him as much as they did. And I was able to do things special in the city that they decided to honor me with the uh, spot in their home. Congratulations, Jim. Among the other inductees were former Ursinus field hockey coach Adele Boyd, former NFL referee Art McNally, who also, by the way, went into the Pro Football Hall of Fame this year, and the 1982-83 world champion 76ers, inducted by that great team's general manager, the legendary Pat Williams. And, oh yeah, WIP's Howard Eskin. Unfortunately, Howard couldn't be there as he was out in Houston for the Eagles' eighth straight victory to start the season. Speaking of the Birds, the team's all-time leader in field goals and points and a five-time Pro Bowl selection, David Akers, was also inducted. Having played 12 of his 16 NFL seasons with the Eagles, David is still a huge fan of the team. First of all, let's talk about the unbeaten Philadelphia Eagles, your old team. What do you think of this team? Oh, my goodness. They're, they're playing amazing right now. It kind of reminds me of the 4 team that we were part of. They, they brought in some, some great free agents. They did a great job in the draft, and they're just balling out right now. Jalen Hurts has hit it to another level. The receivers are playing amazing. Defense has really stepped up. They have some, some other guys that have kind of come in this year. Uh, Riddick, one that just kind of comes to mind, the way he's playing Slay. Obviously, coming in from Detroit uh, a couple of years ago, and I was able to play with Slade with rookie oh. year in Detroit, and and so when you see what John Gannon's kind of doing there, and what Sirianni's kind of put together offensively, it's been pretty impressive. Yeah, it's exciting times for sure. Uh, speaking of exciting times, you going into the Philadelphia Sports Hall of Fame, being honored by the city you played so many great seasons. What does that mean to you? Well, Philly changed my life. The fans really just I have so much gratitude to them. But obviously, you deserve somebody has the opportunity to play for 12 years you know, in, a, in a time where that's that's not an easy task to do. So very, very appreciative and a ton of gratitude, not only for the Eagles organization, but Andy Reid and, and uh, Jeffrey Lord for that matter. But it's an honor just to be in the same room with these other athletes that are up here. And uh, for, for that, I'm just extremely grateful. Last thing, you got a Super Bowl prediction? First. All right, I like it. I like the way David thinks. Congrats to David Akers, J. Roll, Howard Eskin, Coach Martelli, and all of this year's Philadelphia Sports Hall of Fame inductees.